Living in Hawaii, we have the benefit of warm weather, which gives us the chance to be active outdoors for most of the year, but that could also lead to an increase in injuries. This morning on Ask a Specialist, we'll talk about what you need to know with Dr. Daniel Lim, an orthopedic surgeon at the Queen's Medical Center. Good morning, doctor. Thanks for joining us today. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Yes, it's an important topic because we have a lot of great athletes out there, but with with athletes and with sports comes a risk for injuries. Yeah, it's true, and it's actually especially true here in Hawaii. Uh, we're fortunate to live and blessed to live in a place that has great weather mm -hmm. almost every day of the year. Mm -hmm. And with that comes weather where we can be doing sports and our activities all year round. We don't have the winters that give us a little break and most people think this is a good thing, mm -hmm. but sometimes this can be a little bit of a risk. And one of those risks is that we don't give our body enough time to rest. And we become at risk for overuse injuries. Mm. We can play every month of the year. Mm -hmm. Youth athletics can go all year round. And the trouble with that is that we can get overuse injuries. Okay, so what should folks do if they think they might have an injury, especially if it's been going on continuously? Uh, that's a really important question because number one is most people know if something's wrong. It's right. not your typical ache and pain. Don't ignore it is the first thing. The second thing, and actually probably the most important thing, is getting an accurate diagnosis. Okay. You want to know what's going on and from there we can guide the right treatments at the right time. Mm -hmm. What you don't want to do is waste a lot of time or push yourself in, in, a, in a situation that could be dangerous. And those are things that we want to prevent. Mm -hmm. So a prompt, accurate diagnosis is important. Seeing the right specialist is also important. And what other kind of advice do you have, not just for athletes out there, but just those weekend warriors? Because someone watching might think, oh, I'm not doing any kind of continuous sport all season long. I'm not a teenager. I just play pickleball on the weekends. What do you say to those weekend warriors? Yeah, Hawaii, Hawaii is, a, is a very special place in my heart. I'm, I'm from here, but I've also been fortunate to take care of some of the professional athletes on the mainland. And... There's actually quite a bit of similarities between people in Hawaii and those professional athletes. So a couple of things to think about. One is keeping in mind we're in it for the long haul. Play the long game. Mm -hmm. Think about long-term goals. Take care of yourself. Uh, being open to change as our bodies change, as the ath athletics that we participate in evolve, we want to evolve with that and make the right decisions to avoid injury. If you get injured, if you see healthcare experts, it's important for you to learn as much as you can because if you become your own expert, you can do the right things for your body. And the last thing is, there's a lot of support here in the community. Uh, our group here at Queens is willing and able to help and we wanna keep you doing the things that you love. And to learn more about the services provided by Queen's Orthopedics Department, you can visit www.queens.org, click on services, then click on orthopedics, or you can contact Queen's Orthopedic Associates at 808-686-4010. Dr. Lim, thank you so much for stopping by. A very important topic for all of us here in Hawaii. Thanks for having me.